This is Unity, Joy of Life. I'm Nancy Norman, and this is your weekly word. In How to Let God Help You, Myrtle Fillmore says, don't bother about what others may think or say about you. God loves you and approves of what you do when you are doing your best to follow the Jesus Christ way. The opinions of others cannot get you down or lift you up. You have the power of God within you to raise yourself up to where you know you are his child with the ability along all lines and with freedom to do whatever you really wish to do. God is helping you now to know that this is the truth. God is showing you that your best dreams are coming true that you are to forget the past and its disappointments, that you are to do everything as though you were doing it for God. God is a great loving father who is interested in you, who can and will help you. He will supply your needs and show you how to keep happy and healthy. You cannot hope for peace, joy, health, abundance, and opportunity for greater development as long as your subconscious mind is weighted down with old, old burdens. When you desire with all of your heart to live the God, the, the plan, live the life that God has planned for, for you, you will find old beliefs and habits crumbling just as Jesus met the old beliefs of sorrow and suffering and death and rose triumphantly out of them. So you have the light and power to meet your beliefs of sorrow, lack, failure, and death, and to rise out of them in the true Christ consciousness of life. I have loved you with an everlasting love. There is nothing nothing that you cannot do. If you have a desire, hold it to your heart and let God help you achieve that desire. For that's what he wants to do. He has a magnificent plan for you and it is to succeed and experience joy every single day. God bless you and have a wonderful day.